Well, the Idaho Steelheads continue along with their season-long six-game homestand here tonight as they welcome the Kansas City Mavericks into town this week for a three-game set beginning this evening at 7.10 p.m. Cam McGuire alongside Steelheads head coach Everett Sheen. Well, Sheener wrapped up the three-game series against Redding this past week, and you were able to grab two points on Saturday night with the 5-2 win. First off, just your overall thoughts from the three games. Uh, you know, it was always good to get that two points there at the end. That was much needed. Uh, I thought we deserved maybe a better fade on Friday. Uh, I thought we played quite well. Their goalie just stood on there, stood on his head and, and robbed us. But, you know, the Wednesday game, no one was happy with. Uh, I thought we responded well with, on the weekend and, you know, able to get two points at the end of the day. I thought Brian Thompson was pretty sharp on Saturday night. 31 saves. He'll get the start here this evening. And great to have him back into a routine and, and back as your quote-unquote starter here going forward. Absolutely. You know, he uh, he played quite well on the weekend, and it's, and it's good to get him back in between the pipes there. You know, he took a little time away, um, and boys are excited to have him back and playing. Earlier today, it was made official that defenseman Patrick Kudla headed to the AHL Syracuse Crunch on a tryout. Now marks seven players that have been with this team that are up in the AHL, but certainly no need to panic as we'll eventually see these guys back at some point. Yeah, you know, they, all those guys up there are well-deserved. Um, you know, they worked hard. They really helped us get off to the start that we did. And, you know, they're getting rewarded with a chance up in the American League. And, you know, whether they stay there for the rest of the season and rejoin us in playoffs, hopefully, or, you know, maybe it's a week or two. But, uh, you know, we have a good core here. Guys are stepping up uh, to fill in those spots. And at the end of the day, you know, we'll have our, our complete team back uh, when, it, when it matters the most. Defensively speaking, with the loss of Kudla, down to six active defensemen on the roster now. But one piece who I thought played pretty solid in the last two games was Lincoln Earn, an acquisition that you guys made last week. Yeah, he came in, you know, kept it simple. Uh, he's a big, heavy, right shot D-man. Um, you know, we knew we were getting with him, a good kid off the ice, and good hard work, and I was, I was very impressed with those first two games. Seems like over the last couple of weeks, you guys have been bouncing back and forth with some wins and losses, and kind of like we said, no need to panic. The season still very young, and you guys are still tied for first in the division right now. But in terms of building some consistency, how do you guys look to do that here over the next couple of weeks? You know, now that we got a few new bodies in here, um, you know, that cohesiveness will start to come, and you know, our guys are. You know, they're committed to playing the right way and, you know, keeping it simple when needed. And, you know, even if we are short bodies, we know we got to just play simple hockey, um, get pucks in and, and go to work. Looking ahead at tonight's matchup with the Mavericks, we mentioned the Steelheads and Kansas City, each with 47 points. Coach, this is a club that hasn't played yet in the calendar year. Their last game coming on December 31st. So how do you take advantage of that here this evening? Well, we've got to come out right away. Um, you know, they're probably well rested, obviously, you know. I always found as a player when I took that much time off, it was a little rusty to start the game. So we got to take advantage of that and come out flying. Um, you know, we can't be too pretty with the puck. You know, limit our turnovers. And just play simple hockey. You guys played them for three games earlier in December in Kansas City. It took four out of a possible six points. These will be the final three games of the season against Kansas City. So how valuable are these points here over the next couple of days? Oh, very. Um, you know, it's a team we're probably going to be battling with for first in the division uh, all the way for the rest of the year. So last three against them, we got to make sure we take some points off them and uh, make it count. There you have it. That's Steelheads head coach Everett Sheen. Sheen, as always, we appreciate the time. Best of luck and have some fun tonight. Appreciate it, Cam.